Okay, so I've come across a tricky problem, and I just did in this house, but this is the second toilet. This has been uh, redone a little sooner, but what you'll have is that this is a modern enough toilet that the bolts are nice and solid, if you can tell. It doesn't spin. Now, it can still spin if it's too deep, uh, which is a real problem when you go to put your nut on the top of the toilet, and if it just keeps spinning, you're just stuck. A lot of times, it will be the flange that only has that little lip in it like this. That will be the older flange. So I'm going to show you what to do on that. Use a 3 inch deck screw here. Be right back. Okay, so this is something of an example. You see I was able to just drive the deck screw down beside the uh, bolt itself there. And um, this, thus stabilizing it. So now it won't rotate. Now that's in theory because uh, this flange is just fine but all their older flanges all they have is a hole there as if you're going to put a threaded type anchor down into the floor that's just going to come through it and it's not actually meant to be held by the flange. So in that case you do need to have something to stabilize it. Uh, something else to keep in mind and this is what I had to do upstairs is I didn't get this figured out until afterward. So here's the toilet. I was actually able to put my deck screw right here, right down the hole, right beside my bolt, stabilizing my, my bolt up here, and I was able to put the nut on and finish the job. So a three inch screw on each side it can do wonders, especially if you already have the toilet place and you find out your bolts won't hold like happened to me. Thanks for watching.